Hey, this is Mike with Plus 8 Precision. Um, I guess I'll turn this into a quick video on using an edge finder to pick up an edge. I'll try to give you several different views uh, and what I'm doing. Uh, to start, this is 3 8 with a 200 um, edge shank. I always set the machine up in this case my knee mill up around a thousand RPM some may argue with that that's what I've been doing for almost 30 years so I set it up at a thousand RPM that way it kicks off good it's easy to see you won't see it from this view I'll bring you in from this view and you'll see that part of it so let me kind of show you we go through the steps here uh, block is already in it's on parallels I have access to this edge I have access to this edge so this will be my J corner this back corner although I don't really need anything this way I'm gonna mill a through pocket on this block which will not be covered in this video but the whole point of this is picking up this edge Right now, it just bumped off center, which means I'm really close to this edge. So, because I'm going to be setting up this side of this side of X, that's going to be positive. So, since this is 200, we're going to split that in half. I'm going to set my DRO for 0.1. And then I'll move it back to zero. And we should be right on that edge. I know it's hard to see. I think this is a better view, being able to see that we are splitting that diameter in half with the edge. Okay, so I'll show you another view. Okay, so from this edge, or this angle, I'm going to show you this edge, and this time you'll be able to see the center finder kick off when I just find the edge. There are other ways of finding the edges of details, but this is just usually the most common method that machinists uh, use. It's quick, it's down and dirty, but there are other more accurate ways. But I'm only covering using an edge finder in this video. Go back and come off of the edge again. So there we have it. You saw me set the edge from the other angle. 
so I'm going to show you the DRO and what the dimension is and there's the DRO I set it at a hundred thousandths positive in X and you can see finding it again I'm within two tenths of where I was at in the previous uh, view that I showed you so even though I don't consider this a a 100% highly accurate dimension if you're if you're working in very close tolerances if you get experience and you can use the edge finder well it will provide you with very good results and accuracy all right that wraps up this video this is Mike with plus eight precision so if you like the videos that I'm putting out please take time to subscribe Give me a comment. Um, if you disagree, if you like, you dislike, there's remedies for all that within YouTube. Um, again, this is Mike with Plus 8 Precision. Thanks for watching.